Yo, yo, what's going on everybody? Happy Monday and welcome back to another video. So today I thought that I would just cook up whatever I'm feeling today. I'm not really sure what direction I want to go in, but I have a couple of sample packs on my computer that I downloaded like a couple years ago that I haven't even dug into yet. And so I think I'm going to cook up with some loops and uh, try to make something dope. So without further ado, let's cook up. So I have some packs over here that I just want to check out. And I have this one from Cymatics, and it's their Gems Volume 4 pack, which I think I got like a year or two ago. I'm not entirely sure, but it's got it's got some, some loops in it. So I'm going to check some of these out and just play a few and see if something catches my ear. I like this one a lot. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna do that one. One. What was it? One thirty-seven. All right. So first, just gonna put an EQ on it. Take out a little bit of the low end here. Not too much. Um. All right. So I'm gonna go to put some drums on it, just to catch a little bit of a of a vibe here, just to kind of see what direction I'm going. This is a good hi-hat, I like this. And then I kinda wanna have like a, a little roll here. So a quick shortcut, if you select the note you want and hit Alt and then U, it'll kinda turn it into a little roll. Ooh, I like that. All right, all right, all right. I feel like I almost want like a drill 808, something that's kind of long. But uh, we'll see. Maybe I'll even go. Maybe I'll use two 808s and have like the downbeat be a long one and then switch it to a shorter one. Boom, boom, boom. This is too soon, that's why. Maybe I'll just... And then I kind of hear... I like that pattern. I kind of hear like maybe another hi-hat or something underneath it. And then just something like that we want to randomize, but Thank you. 
that's kind of like the main the main idea that I have. Now I'm going to do a little bit more with this sample. Get another one here, make this unique. And probably send this to its own mixer track. Take some of the lows off. Do have stems. Okay, that's helpful. So then maybe what I'll do is I'll pull these in. I like how stripped down it is because you can still sense that there's rhythm and there's a little bit of melody, but it's not quite the the main marimba part. So this is what, eight bars. So then we duplicate that. And then maybe for this section, we bring it back up to normal. Take these out, just move this up, pull that out. Good. All right, and then duplicate that over. And then what I wanna do is, and then boom, it drops right there. make this one unique and then I might pull this one up an octave just to provide a little bit more since we're kind of just using the sample as much as we can nice and then okay cool so now just before I preview it I just want to add a couple of little effects like that great so now that we have everything arranged here's the final beat Yo, JD. That is it for this video thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching with me on your monday as always please like drop a comment subscribe uh, again just doing all those things really makes it possible for me to be able to keep putting out this awesome content for you so yeah again thank you guys so much for all your support and i will see you next week peace